Now a consumer alert, Kia is recalling nearly 100,000 SUVs due to a brake problem. And this recall affects the 2023 Sportage. The National Highway Transportation Safety Administration says the problem is with the brake booster diaphragm. They can become misaligned and that could cause the SUV to lose power. Owners should call their dealer for an inspection. And that brings us to NBC5 Response today and many dangerous recalls right now on Chicago streets. A new report found tens of thousands of vehicles in Chicago have some of the most serious recalls waiting to be repaired. They can be a danger to you or your neighbors, and there's a free way to find out if you're driving at risk. Here's Lexi Suter with more. This is not a climactic battle from a Marvel movie. What you're seeing is a Takata airbag exploding in a lab test recorded by federal regulators, highlighting the power and danger that was in millions of vehicles nationwide. Owners are worried about their safety and the safety of their families. Takata explosions killed 23 people in the U.S. and injured as many as 400. Vehicles with these airbags were recalled in 2014. Yet, still today, millions of these airbags are sitting, waiting to be replaced. And that's just one recall. There are some recalls out there that simply can't be avoided. Case in point, a new report out by Carfax this month found millions of vehicles on the road with serious recalls waiting to be repaired here locally. There are about 92,000 of these vehicles in Illinois, and there are about 70,000 in the Chicago region, which of course also overlaps with Indiana and Wisconsin. Vehicle recalls are not all created equal, but these ones are serious, like do not drive and park outside warnings. Just recently, Jeep Cherokee announced it was recalling 132,000 vehicles at risk of a fire sparking, even when the engine's off. Those vehicles are under park outside warnings since the fire could spread. The automaker says repairs for that problem are still in development. The reason why so many cars are still left unrepaired could come down to how drivers are notified by first class mail. It is not the primary form of communication that it once was. And that means drivers may have recalls on their cars and they don't even know it. So how do you check? Well, there's a way and it's free. You just need a VIN or a license plate. We've linked more information on our website at NBCChicago.com consumer. Lexi Suter, NBC5 Response. Important information. Thanks to Lexi. Yeah.